It's 95 degrees today in New Jersey, so I had hot nuts on the mind when I went to the grocery store and I saw these bad boys. Blue Diamond Extreme Carolina Reaper. Now they also had some habanero ones, uh, but this guy was claiming the four flames. All right, now this is a totally impromptu video. I'm doing this on my phone, not even my main camera, uh, but I saw these bad boys. I had to have them and I figured, let's make a video. Let's see how hot they really are. I have a pretty good tongue for how hot things are. Now, uh, they don't make any claims of Scoville units. Carolina Reapers, that's, that's some hot stuff right there. I personally would not pop one of those in my mouth willy-nilly. Just some almonds here. I imagine they're gonna be dusted with uh, salted uh, dust of, you know, Satan's butthole or something. They do not smell, you know how sometimes hot stuff has that acidic smell? See in there? Just some nuts. Nothing too special. Not immediate heat. That better not be all the heat that's coming. Let's get a mouthful. Really test it out. Sorry for the road noise. I'm at a friggin' park on my lunch break. I'm disappointed, Blue Diamond. If you're gonna put Carolina Reaper on the jar and give it the coveted four flames, I shouldn't be able to talk this calmly after eating a handful of them. What the triple axle dump truck go by. Take a nice little, little handful there. Hmm. That was too many. I just mean too many to chew. I've had, I've had, it, it's less heat than eating a raw jalapeno. I mean, it's hot, but I'll bet these are 3,500 Scoville units. Now the ingredients are almonds and then Carolina Reaper seasoning, which is maltodextrin, salt, spices, citric acid, onion powder, paprika extract, white vinegar powder, natural flavors, garlic powder, Carolina Reaper, chili powder, tomato powder, yeast extract, uh, acetic acid. So you gotta get pretty far down on the, um, the list before you even get to the Carolina Reaper pepper. I mean, they're good and I'd buy them again. But if you, Carolina Reaper carries with it, that's, that's the big daddy, right? Like the Butte Jaloak, or like Habanero back in the day. If you say Carolina Reaper, like if I go to a wing place and they say they got Carolina Reaper, Reaper wings, I want to think I'm gonna die. I want to almost die. If you're gonna put Carolina Reaper on some hot nuts, even on a hot day, 95 degrees here in Jersey, I'm barely sweating. I'm sweating, but it's not from these nuts. So would I recommend them? Yes, I bought them at Weiss. They were like three dollars and fifty cents. They taste good, and I love almonds. They're a great snack. Let's see. There's six servings per container, so I probably just ate about three, two or three servings. Yeah, maybe two servings. 170 calories per serving. 20 percent of your total fat, but I mean that's how nuts go. Uh, they're a good source of protein, though. Six grams, five grams of carbs per uh, serving. So. In general, almonds are a great snack, especially if you're like uh, like a high protein guy like I am. If you like hot food, I mean, now somebody who doesn't eat hot food, this might melt their face a little bit, but so would biting into a raw jalapeno. So I don't know, go hot or go home. I think I think you're you're telling me go hot or go home, Blue Diamond. Come on, truck. 
No respect for the film industry. I'm telling you to go home. Blue Diamond. I wish that there were more products for, um, I'm not insane with heat. Like some people are. I mean, some people will eat raw Carolina Reapers like that one dude. Or even the guy from the show Hot Ones. But I'm in the upper 10% of, of heat tolerance. And I, I just wish there were more uh, off-the-shelf products without just straight-up drinking hot sauce that uh, but lived up to it. With a, with a label like this, I mean, you should have seen, you know, you got the normal label. It's like blue. Then they had the habanero one, which is like orange. I mean, this one looks like death. This one looks like it should be uh, at least 100,000 Scoville. Anyway, would I recommend them? Yes. Was I a little bit disappointed? Yes. Uh, but decent heat. Better than you're going to get in any other quote-unquote hot nut. I think uh, Blue Diamond has a jalapeno cashew that barely tickles the tongue. So, I don't know. If you like hot stuff, I got a good video on uh, the right way to taste hot sauce. Because everybody's doing it wrong. Bet you didn't even know you were doing it wrong. You are. Go watch that. I'll link that. Go watch one of my other videos or don't. I don't really care. This is not my main channel. This is just the channel where I do stuff like stop on my lunch bake. Bake. Amateur hour. Break and eat some hot nuts. All right. See y'all later.